Hi, you're watching the Daily Attendance for eLearning video tutorial. In this video, I will walk you through the import and setup of the HCPS Attendance for eLearning quiz. This quiz was created to facilitate the recording of official daily attendance, especially on days when you're not Zooming with your students before 11 a.m., which is the official time daily attendance must be recorded in EdConnect. The quiz is worth zero points, but is made to appear in the gradebook, providing you a record of attendance. It will be important to educate your students and parents that these quizzes are for attendance only and not included in the grade. So in the to-do list, your students will have an attendance quiz. They click on it. You'll come to the begin page. The student would click on begin. And here they're presented with a click here to record your attendance. You can click anywhere in there, submit. They'll be asked, are you sure you want to submit? And then they can see their results. Now I wanna show you how to import this quiz from Commons and set it up. Once you're in the course where you would like to import it, you can go to Commons. It doesn't matter which one you use, import from Commons or here. You'll see that it's featured, so it's right up front. But if not, you can always search for it just by putting in attendance. And then when you're ready to import, you click on it. You click on import. I've got a lot of courses, so I'm going to type in sandbox. I'm taking it to my sandbox. So I'm going to click on that and I'm going to import the course. It will say successfully imported. You can go back to your course. and go down to quizzes and you'll see it's there to set it up the way i want to set it up i will click edit it's zero points which is what i want and i'm looking at points so i've got that set up and then i have to set up the due and available from this is august 24th the first day of school so it's due at 11 a.m on august 24th the first day of school. I want it available for those students who might get up early to do it. I want it available the beginning of that day. And then I want it available until the 24th at 11 a.m. I can click save once I am sure that it is the way I want it to be. It will show me the quiz. I do not have to do anything here. I can just hit return. It takes me back to assignments, which is where new quizzes live. Um, depending on whether the publish is toggled on or off in the way that I want it, I'm gonna check that and then I'm gonna hit duplicate. And I've duplicated it and now I can create the second daily attendance quiz. So I'll go to edit and change the name to what I would like it to be, 25th. I need to change the date from the 24th to the 25th. It stays 11 a.m., so I don't have to do anything with that. Zero points. I want to go to more options because I have to set these as well. 25th at 12 stays the same. 25th at 11 stays the same. I click Save and Publish and takes me to the quiz again. I hit return and I can see them there and they're both published. Now let's go over to see what it will look like for students because they are published and I click student view on the home page. You will see that they can see both of those. That may be okay for some people. Um, some people may not want to show them. So if I do not want to show them, I've got to go back and unpublish them. And then I go back home and I go back to student view. You may have to reset the student view sometimes for it to show up, but you'll see now there is nothing there. 
I hope you have found this video useful in importing and setting up daily attendance quizzes into Canvas. If you have further questions or you need further support, remember that we have tier one support with Canvas. We also have the teacher guides that are available in the help menu on the global navigation menu. Have a great day.